Good evening, teacher. Hi, good evening. How are you? I am fine. Mire, me encerró la lluvia aquí en el trabajo, así que aquí ni modo, la voy a recibir aquí. Ah, ok. <ríe> Está bien, lo importante es que la reciba. Sí, gracias, teacher. <ríe> ok, you're welcome. Está lloviendo fuerte por ahí. Fíjese que todavía no ha comenzado, pero ya está el viento bien fuerte, ya casi. Ya casi, ok. Ya va, va a refrescar también el calor. Ay, sí. <risa> ya casi iniciamos. Está bien. Okay, it's the time to start. How are you today? How are you, babies? Good, good evening. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? I am fine. Okay, excellent, Delmira. How was your day? ¿Cómo estuvo su día? Nine. How was your day? Nine. Estuvo bien, ¿verdad? Repeat, please. Nice. 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 Yeah, I'm very well. Excellent. Estoy todavía de camino a casa. Voy manejando, pero ya en un momentito me conecto. Okay. Okay, excellent. There is no problem. Be careful. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Now, what about Erwin? How are you, Erwin? Fine. Thank you. Okay. How was your day? It is a little heavy. Little heavy. Okay. Are you tired? Uh, Está cansado? Are you tired? Yes. Yes. Okay. I understood. <laughs> okay. And how was your weekend? ¿Cómo estuvo su fin de semana? Uh, It was mm. busy, ocupado. Uh, I took a rest, tomé un descanso. Eh, salimos. Go out. Salimos my with family. Your, ah, and then I go out with my family. Excellent. Okay. Excellent, Erwin. Thanks a lot. What about Reina? How was your day, Reina? I'm fine. Okay, how was your weekend? More working, teacher. Working. Oh, are you hard working? Yes. Yes. <laughs> hey, I know. It. And how was your day? Bye. It was nice. Yes. Okay, excellent. Now, what about, let me see, Stephanie, how was your day, Stephanie? Good night. Hi, good evening. evening. How was your day? Bien, tranquilo. It was nice? Nice. Sí. Oh, yes. okay. Are you tired? Está cansada. Are you tired? Un poco. <laughs> a little bit. A little bit, sí. Ok, ok, nice. Now, do you remember about our last class? ¿Qué recuerdan de la última clase? Please help me. ¿Qué vimos en la semana? ¿Qué aprendieron en la semana? Cuéntenme. Can you tell me, please? What topic we saw last week? Yes. Double question. Yes. Questions. Can you tell me one question, please? Ask me. Pregúnteme algo de lo que vimos la semana pasada. 
hágame una pregunta. Por ejemplo, using what, using where, which, what else? Using why. Eh, a ver. Any question, cualquier pregunta. Eh, where do you live? Where... Okay, I live in San Salvador. I live in San Salvador. What about you? Where do you live? I live in Hilo Vasco. In Hilo Vasco. Okay, excellent. Now, can you tell me another question to me, please? Using W questions. How old are you? Um, I told you last week that I have amnesia. I don't remember <laughs> <laughs> my age, but I think I think it's between forty and and between fifty. Okay. Yeah, but I don't remember. But probably I think fifteen, maybe. Okay. Fifteen years old. <laughs> and what about you? How old are you? I am. Yeah. Twenty-nine years old. Twenty-nine years old. Excellent. Now, ask must more questions. More questions. Using W words. Another. Another question? What's your favorite color and why? And my favorite color is dark blue because I like it. Yeah. Okay, teacher. <laughs> okay, another, another question. The last question. And what about you, Francisco? What is your favorite color? The, the hecho is the topic for today, colors. Okay. Yes, this day we saw. I color. think that my favorite color is red. Red, and why? I think um, uh, for the colors of on the cars, for example. Ah, okay. I like it. Okay, excellent. Now, uh, this week we saw different topic. They are very important and nice. Let me introduce your next topic. Next topic is closest vocabulary. Did you receive my information, my extra material today? Yes. 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 Vieron que se lo mandé dos veces, twice, ¿verdad? Yes. Se los mandé dos veces. El último, es que fíjense que no me había fijado que la primera página se veía, casi no se leía. Entonces se los arreglé y se los volví a enviar y ahora ya se ve bien. ¿Ya? Es para material e infor información extra para que ustedes mm -hmm. puedan aprender más, más vocabulario acerca de la ropa. Nada. Ahorita vamos a repasarlo ya. Ok. Closest vocabulary mm -hmm. is the topic for today. And this topic is very important that we can use every day. First one. Me. The, our first clothes. Clothes. Yes, clothes. Now, here we have clothes for work clothes. and clothes for leisure. Please repeat after me. Clothes for work. Closet for work. Again, closet for work. Closet for work. Now, closet for leisure. Closet for leisure. Again, closet for leisure. Closet for leisure. Okay, now, in this time, I will put the audio and please read at the same time. Pay attention to the pronunciation and read at the same time. Ven bien o se los hago más grande, la letra esta. 
Un poquito oh, más okay. grande, teacher, por favor. Ok, ok. Now. Just a minute. ¿Podría, por favor, pronunciar sí. solo la última palabra de esta última oración? Leisure. 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 Ahorita se, le, se lo voy a poner también en el audio. Leisure. What is okay. the meaning? Ok. The meaning is, y ese es ropa for informal. Ropa ah, informal. Okay. The first one is... Clothes for work, ropa formal para trabajar. And clo clothes for leisure is ropa informal. ¿Ya? Yeah? Okay. Ya vamos a ver ese punto. Now, please pay attention to the pronunciation. Let me see. For work. Shirt. Tie. Belt, jacket, pants, suit, coat, shoes, blouse, scarf, skirt, high heels. Raincoat, dress, clothes for leisure, hat, sweater, jeans, gloves, boots, cap, t-shirt, Shorts, socks, sneakers, pajamas, swimsuits. Okay, can you listen again? El audio estaba un poco bajo. Está bajo, ¿verdad? Vaya, lo voy a poner más alto. Let me see. Y lo que vamos a hacer es, lo escuchan y lo vamos a repetir al mismo tiempo, así rapidito para seguir escuchando las, la, las, eh, las, las otras palabras. Let me see. Está muy suavecito, vamos a ponerlo más fuerte. Let me see. ¿Escuchan más fuerte en este momento? Yes. Yes. Vale, se lo voy a poner así, bastante fuerte. Ok. Now, pay attention again. For work. Shirt. Shirt. Tie. Shirt. Tie. Belt. Tie. Belt. Jacket. Belt. Jacket. Jacket. Pants. 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 Suit. Coat. Suit. Suit. Coat. Shoes. Coat. Coat. Shoes. Blouse. Shoes. Blouse. Blouse. Let me see. Skirt. Skirt. High arm. High heels. Raincoat. High heels. Raincoat. Dress. Dress. Raincoat. Dress. 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 Leisure. Only listen. Okay. Hat. Leisure. Sweater. Mm. Sweater. Jeans. Gloves. Gloves. Boots. 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 Cap. T-shirt. Shirt. Shorts. Shirt. Socks. 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 Sneakers. Sneaker. Pajamas. Pajamas. Swimsuit. 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 Okay, now 
Que lo voy a bajar un poquitito. Ya estaba bien fuerte. Pero lo escucharon mejor, ¿verdad? Ok. Now. Please repeat after me. Clothes for work. Clothes for work. Shirt. 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 Tie. Tie. Your shirt significa camisa. Miren, es la camisa que él lleva por dentro. Short. Aquí está la flecha. Sure. Miren. Short. Es la camisa. Significa Tie. camisa. Tie. Tie. It, it means corbata. Corbata. Belt. Belt. What is the meaning of belt? Pincho. Pincho. Yeah. Yeah. Now, jacket. 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 Pants. Pants. Here, both suit. are the meaning suit. 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 Aquí, sí. miren, la, la, la chaqueta y el pantalón forman un traje porque es el mismo color. Y traje se dice suit. 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 Aquí lo pusieron individual porque solamente es la chaqueta y el pantalón. Pero ya ambos significa suit. Ya suit. significa traje, suit. Now, coat. 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 What is the meaning no. of coat? Abrigo. Saco. Okay. Saco. O como abrigo, yes, but saco. Now, shoes. Yes, no shoes. Shoes. Yes. Son los zapatos. Ya, yeah. zapatos de vestir. Shoes. Zapatos. Now, what about hair? Blouse. 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 Blouse es la blusa que lleva adentro. Miren, hasta aquí lleva la flechita, la blusa de adentro. Blouse. Yeah. Scarf. 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 Bufanda. Scarf, it means bufanda. Now, skirt. 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 Again, skirt. 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 No es, sino que solo con la S. Skirt. 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 Eso significa falda. Skirt significa falda. Now, hide heels. Ah, high heels. High heels. High heels. It means high heels. zapatos de tacón. Mm -hmm. Son zapatos de tacón. High heels. High heels. High heels. Zapatos de tacón. Now, raincoat. Raincoat. Rain. Rain. Esta es una capa impermeable. Para hoy que llueve, miren, es capa impermeable. Rain cut. Rain cut. Rain cut. Yeah. Rain cut. Now. Here we have dress. 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 What is the meaning of dress? Vestido. Vestido. Excellent. Now. Clothes for leisure. Clothes for leisure. For leisure. Aquí, miren, lleva TH. Cuando es TH lo pronunciamos como Z. Clothes. Clothes for leisure. Leisure. For leisure. What is the meaning of leisure? Es el vestuario informal, ¿verdad? Leisures. Yeah. Ropa informal. Like this one. The first one is hat. 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 What is the meaning of hat? Hat. Sombrero. Gorro, sombrero. Yeah. Ya vamos a ver algunas diferencias. Gorro, sombrero. Now, globos. Globos. What is the meaning of globos? Guantes. 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 Globos. Son guantes. Globos. Now, sweater. 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 What is the meaning of sweater? Sweater. 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 Yeah. Now, 
Boots. 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 What is the meaning of boots? Botas. 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 Excellent. Now, here we have pajamas. 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 Now, here, cup. 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 What is the meaning of cup? Gorra. Gorra. The shirt. The shirt. The shirt. The shirt. It means camiseta. Camiseta. The shirt. Camiseta. Camiseta. Now, shorts. 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 Now, socks. 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 What is the meaning of socks? Calcetines. 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 Socks. Yes, calcetines. Now, sneakers. 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 Esos son, eh, son, son unos okay. tipos de zapatos. Ya vamos a ver ahí otro, otros ejemplos en el, el material extra que les envía. Aquí lo tengo también la presentación para mostrarles. Uh, we have different kinds of, of uh, shoes too, right? Sneakers es una clase de zapatos, ya, yeah? que son cómodos, son esta hechura que se ve acá. Pero ya vamos a ver otros tipos también de zapatos. Now, swimsuits. Swimsuits. Swim What is the meaning of swimsuit? Son trajes de baño. Son trajes de baño. Swim, swim suit. Swim suit. Swim suit. Yeah. Now, can you tell me what are your favorite clothes for work? My favorite clothes is the chair. Yeah, the shirt. Sure. Okay, here. My favorite clothes, only the shirt. No, are the shirt and what else? Camiseta and jeans or, oh. or pants? And shorts. Shorts. <laughs> shorts. To work. Do you work in a, in a call center? Es para trabajar, ¿verdad? Para trabajar básico con camiseta y short. Okay. Yes. O for leisure. For, for leisure puede ser para los fines de semana, ¿verdad? Porque es ropa informal. Los fines de semana que no trabajamos, podemos usar ese tipo de ropa. For leisure, right? Pero para trabajar. Oh, sí. I'm yes. sorry, no, 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 Okay, and then tell me for the first one. What are your favorite clothes for work? Um, sneakers. For work, sneakers. And jeans. And jeans. Uh -huh. Ah, okay, for work. Yeah. Do you use the uniform? No. No. Ah, okay. Sneaker and jeans. And yes. who use some some formal clothes to work? Who? Who use some formal clothes to work? ¿Quién usa ropa formal para trabajar? Yes. Ropa formal para trabajar? ¿O qué tipo de ropa usa para trabajar? Es como combinada, teacher, entre formal e informal. Yes. Tell me some examples. Eh, cheer, eh, pants or Short. Vale, dice que vamos a hacer una cosa. Vamos a poner acá la formal to work. Y abajo el leisure, la informal, y luego vamos a, les voy a mostrar el otro tipo de ropa para que tengan otras alternativas de respuesta. Ok, the first one. My favorite clothes are 
Eh, blouse for girls. Blouse. Let me see. Skirt. And pants. Pants too. Yeah. And pants. Ah, and high heels. In my case, I use high heels to work. And high heels. Now. Dejemos esto porque estos son formales. Ahora vamos con la informal. What are your favorite clothes for leisure? What is your favorite clothes for leisure? Can be the shirt. What else? Sneakers. Jeans. Jeans. Yes. Sandalias. Sandals. Yes. Tennis. Cup. Tennis. Cap. Okay. And shorts. What else? Now. Vamos a dejar solamente estos acá. Vamos, les voy a mostrar las otras. Es el material extra que les envié. First. Here we have different kinds of clothes. We have three presentations. This, and this one, and this. But for the moment, I show you the first one. Here we have the most common. The most common are, for example, number one, here say short and long sleeve short. Long sleeve short es una camisa manga larga. Long sleeve. Uh, long sleeve skirt. Skirt significa camisa, solo skirt. Pero si es una camisa manga larga, es long sleeve short. Long sleeve short. The same this one, number one. Es una camisa manga larga. Ya, yeah, entonces es long sleeve short. Now, eh, in, let me see another, this one, number 13. In number 13, we have a dress. This is a common, a common cloth, right? Dress. Miren, aquí está. Aquí les aparecen los números de cada pieza y aquí lo van a buscar. Así se escribe. ¿Ya? Así se escribe. Eh, hay ropa acá que nosotros no la utilizamos en nuestro país, que solamente la usan fuera, fuera del país donde cae nieve, pero se los he puesto a manera de conocimiento. Ya vamos a ver la otra lámina. Acá vamos a ver las más comunes. Por ejemplo, eh, long sleeve shirt, long sleeve shirt is, is common, right? Dress shirt. In number three, let me see, dress shirt. Okay, number, uh, no, no, is uh, This, in number four, sport shirt. In number four, this is sport shirt. This is common. It's common, right? Uh, number five is common too. In number five is polo shirt. Teacher. Tell me. Uh, disculpe, in la numero tres is dress shirt. Es como la. camisa de vestir, digámoslo así. Y yes, es como tipo? camisa, sí, es como camisa de vestir, como aquí tenemos diferentes, diferentes tipos. Dress shirt, le, déjeme ver, dress shirt es, ya le digo. Porque ya parece como que fuera vestido, ¿verdad? La traducción, uh -huh. ya. Yeah. Let me see, dress shirt. Es camisa de vestir, como, como, o sea, dress, se dice vestido, aquí como que quizás lo asocian y le ponen dress, dress shirt, pero ah, okay. la, la traducción es camisa de vestir, la número tres, que también, okay. también podríamos traducirla como la primera, long sleeve shirt, long sleeve shirt, porque es igual, ¿verdad? También yes. es de vestir, right 
yeah, can be the same. Now in okay. number five is common too. In number five is, is polo shirt o, or sport shirt. Es una, una camisa polo, right? You can use to work and you can use for leisure too. Yes or no? Yes. Yes. Now, in number number six, number six, uh, let me see, six, fl uh, flannel skirt, flannel shirt, flannel shirt. Es una camisa de franela. La tela, la tela es de franela, es el, el tipo de tela. Por eso dice flannel short, es camisa, pero de franela. This, this short you can use to work too, right? Now, another common is this one, number 10. Number 10 is jeans, blue jeans, right? Jeans, blue jeans. Now, number for girls, number uh, 12, is common too, there is a skirt, skirt, falda, right? Who can use a skirt to work? Ladies? Who no. can use a skirt to work? ¿Quién usa falda para trabajar? Maybe when you have a meeting in your, in your job, you can use use a skirt because you look like pre pretty elegant yeah now in this one number 22 in number 22 is jacket who use jacket to work quien usa chaqueta para trabajar nadie do you work in an office? No. no? Okay. In some in some in some works or in some jobs, you can use uniform, right? Like this one. Number 20. This one 20 is uniform, like a police, right? Uniform. In some jobs, you can use uniforms. Now, esos son los, los más comunes. Now, this one, for example, for leisure is 15. It's short. You can use short for leisure too. Now, aquí tienen suficiente eh, material, miren, para aprenderse lo que ustedes sientan interés. Ustedes vean el número, se van para acá y buscan qué es. Right? Para que aprendan más vocabulario. It is important to learn a lot of vocabulary. Now, in number two, this is an extra material that, that I send you this day in the morning and in the afternoon too. Now, in this one, in this one we have sleepwear. Can you repeat after me? Sleepwear. 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 What is the meaning of sleepwear? Ropa de dormir. Ropa de dormir, yes. Ropa de dormir, sleepwear. Underwear. 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 And we have footwear. 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 Okay. What is the meaning of underwear? Underwear. underwear. Ropa, ropa de baño. No. Underwear, okay. vean, vean, los, vean los, los dibujos y, y vean ahí qué puede ser. Yes. Como ropa cómoda para... Es, underwear es la ropa interior. Ropa interior. Yes. Oh. Underwear, it means ropa interior. Ya sea para hombre o para mujer. Underwear. is in general. Ropa interior. En footwear, es la... la Calzado, el footwear es la ropa de, de, de los pies. Footwear, por ejemplo, calcetines, medias, todo lo que va relacionado a nuestros pies. Ya, yeah, footwear. Like, here we have some examples. In number one, we have pajamas. Ya, yeah? 
Pajamas. Pijamas, right? In Spanish. But in, in English is pajamas. Now in number two, nightgown. Night. What is the meaning of nightgown? Nightgown night is camisón. Camisón. Uh, yes, <laughs> nightgown. Camisón, nightgown. In number two. Night yeah. For example, night. In, tell me. Uh, okay, this is a sleepwear, one. Another, what about underwear? Underwear que es la ropa interior, right? Here we have this one, for example, this one, number seven. Number seven, hockey short o underpants. Eso significa calzoncillos o pantalones cortos, like this one, yeah? Number seven. Jockey, short, or underpants. Yeah? In number eight, for example, number eight. Boxer short. Boxer short. This is a boxer. It's a underwear, too. It's a kind of underwear. Now, for women, number 11. 11, it means bikini, panties, or underpants. Yeah, bikini panties or underpants. Yeah, can you use it? It's like bloomer or calzón in, in Spanish, right? It's the underwear for women. Now, in this one, number 13, number, let me see, 13. Yeah, 13 is bra. Yeah. Bra, it means brasier, right? In English, it's bra. Bra. Now, for footwear, here we have dif different kinds of shoes. For example, in number 20, in number 20, we have socks. Socks. What is the meaning of socks? Son calcetines, right? Calcetines. Calcetines. In number 21, Nick shoes. Nick socks. Calcetines también, que son calcetines más largos. Knee socks. Now, here different kind of shoes. In number 22. 22 shoes. Son zapatos formales, shoes. Now, in number 23. High heels. Zapato de tacón. High heels. 24. Pumps. 24, palms, palms, it means zapatillas, like this one, zapatillas. Now, in number 27, 27, tennis shoes, tennis shoes, here in 27. In 26, sneakers, sneakers, son también de deportes. Uh, sneakers. 28. Running shoes. Running shoes. Son zapatos para correr. para correr. Yes, running shoes. Now here we have this one. Uh, 30, 31. 31. Flip flops. Thongs or flip flops. Are this one. Like sandals. Sandals, right? O chancletas, this one, chancletas, yeah? And then you can use this vocabulary too, this vocabulary, vocabulary, yeah? Usted puede, puede ver también todas estas clases acá en los numeritos que les he puesto abajo, a manera de conocimiento. Now, the last one is exercise clothing and outwears. Exercise clothing and outwear. Esos son ropa para ejercicios, para ejercitarse cuando sale a correr, when you go to the gym too, right? For example, in number, let me see, in number one, for example, is a, a t-shirt, t-shirt, that is camiseta, right? 
t-shirt. Now with number three, let me see if I have another exercise clothing, number three, this one, sweatshirt. Sweatshirt es como una camisa de entrenamiento. Esta, miren, como una sudadera. ¿Ya? Yeah? Sweatshirt, una sudadera. Y number two is tan top. Tan top es una camisa sin mangas, camiseta sin mangas. Tan top. This one. And, Temi. Es como, el, es como el, el centro que se conoce. Yes, yes. Is the same. Now, number number five. In number five is running short. Running short is this one. Running short. Un short para correr. Running short. Yeah. Now, here we have um, the last one. Number six. Number six. Tennis short. Tennis short. Un short para jugar tenis. Right. En aquí ustedes van a encontrar eh, también todos, en toda esta parte de abajo, toda la, esta, eh, qué significa cada uno, right? Hay para que lo revisen en su casa y cualquier duda, pues la pueden eh, buscar en el diccionario o me escriben para darle la respuesta, right? De lo que significa en Spanish. Do you like this information? It's important, right? It's very important because you learn more. Now, please tell your classmate which clothes you prefer. Please tell your classmate which clothes you prefer. Now, can you tell me which clothes you prefer? Volunteer? What kind of, of clothes do you prefer? In my in case, general, teacher, in, in general, yes. Tell uh, me. I prefer uh, the polo shirt because uh, it's more uh, easy. Um, it's, it's more easy to use um, when I go to the to to another uh, office on or another uh, maybe department. Comfortable? Yes, it's more comfortable. Yes, it's more comfortable. Yeah, I prefer polo shirt, polo shirt because it's more comfortable. And another, what else? ¿Qué más aparte de la de la polo shirt? Do you prefer? I prefer jeans because they are more comfortable. Jeans, yeah. What else? Jeans and tennis. Tennis. Tennis, yes. What else? What else? And t-shirt. T-shirt. What else? For, for ladies? Cap. A cap, yes. What else? What others? Ladies? I, I think I prefer gym. Eh, teacher, también es para... para Femenino, For women, también se yes, uh -huh. yes, yes, yeah. Okay. What else? What other kinds of clothes do you prefer? Jeans, t-shirts, tennis. Yeah. I think it's more relaxed. Yes, more relaxed. What else? What other kinds? Yes, for leisure. What kind of clothes do you prefer for leisure? ¿Qué clase de ropa prefiere para, para ropa informal o para fines de semana? Jeans. Shorts. Yes. Jeans, shorts. What else? Sneakers. 
sneakers too. What else? What else? Cap. Repeat, please. Short dress. Dress. Yes, pero eh, vestido corto. Ah, yeah, it can be. Yeah, it can be. Short dress. What short else? Dress. Yes. Sandal. Sandals. Yes. Okay, now. Now, can you tell me what kind of clothes do you prefer to work? What kind of, of clothes do you prefer for work? ¿Qué clase de ropa usted prefiere para trabajar? Ya. Yeah. Shirt. Shirt. Yes. What else? Polo shirt. Polo shirt. Yes. What else? What else? Pants. Let me see. Jeans. Hola, ¿me escuchan? Yes. ¿Me escuch yes, ok. Yes. Es que por accidente le, le desconecté algo aquí a, a, mi, a mi compu, pero ya está bien. Ok. Let me see. Ok. Now, polo shirt, what else? Jeans. Jeans. Yes. Tenis. Tenis. To work, right? Ok, pants, pantalones normales, pants. Yes. Shoes. Shoes. Yes, shoes. Yeah. Now, what kind of clothes do you prefer for leisure? What is the middle leisure? Leisure es la ropa informal, la que utilizamos los fines de semana. Ah, Short. okay. Shorts. Yes. T-shirt. T-shirt. What else? Sneakers. Sneakers. Cap. Yes. Jeans. Cap. Jeans. Tenis. Yes, cap. Shoes. Tennis. Yeah. Let me see. Voy a hacer un poquito más pequeñito esto. Ok, t-shirt, cap, tennis. What Flip else? Flip-flop. Flip-flop, ya. Yeah. Sunglasses. Sandals. En. Tent top. Va, el último. Yeah. Sunglasses. Sunglasses. Yeah. Now, here we have different kinds of clothes that we can use or that we prefer for work. And what kind of clothes do you prefer for leisure? Now, to continue with topic, it's very important to mention colors too. Colors. And let me see, ok. Vamos con los colores. Recuerden que los colores son muy importantes para que nosotros, nosotros podamos escoger los diferentes tipos de ropa, right? Now, can you tell me what is your favorite color? My favorite color is green. It's green. Now, what is your favorite color, eh, Paola? My favorite color is purple. Purple. Okay. Reina, what is your favorite color? Uh, 
my favorite color is black. Is black. Now, let me see, Cesar, what is your favorite color? Um, my favorite color is green. Is green. Now, let me see, Eric, what is your favorite color? My favorite color is blue. Is blue. Another, Delmira, what is your favorite color? My favorite color is yellow. Is yellow. Now, Stephanie, what is your favorite color? My favorite color is dark blue. Is dark blue. Now, yes. let me see, Mauricio, what is your favorite color? And Alexis, what is your favorite color? What is your favorite color? Orange. Orange. And then it's my favorite color Maybe. is orange. Yeah. Now, Francisco, what is your favorite color? My favorite color is red. Red. And Nelson, what is your favorite color? My favorite color is gray. It's green. Okay, excellent. Now you are very smart. Now, Edwin, what is your favorite color? My favorite color is, is dark blue. Very nice. Very good. Now, here we have different kinds of colors. And then, in this time, I put the audio and please read at the same time. Okay, let me see. Now, please pay attention. Light gray. Dark gray. Gray. Dark gray. Dark gray. Beige. Light brown. Brown. Dark brown. Black. Red. Pink. Orange. Yellow. Light green. Green. Dark green. Light blue. Blue. Dark blue. Purple. Now, we're going... Okay. Now, please repeat after me. White. The first one is white. 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 L light white. gray. Light, light gray. 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 Dark gray. Dark, Dark gray. gray. Beige. 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 Light brown. Light, light brown. 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 brown, brown, dark brown, dark brown, brown. Black. Black. black, red, red, red. red. Pink. Pink. pink, orange, 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 orange. Yellow. 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 yellow, light green. Light green. Green. green, 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 dark green, dark green, green. light blue, light, light, light blue. 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 blue, blue, dark blue, 
Dark. Purple. What is the meaning of light green? This one? Verde, Verde claro. claro. Verde claro. Yes. What is the meaning of dark green? Verde, 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 oscuro. Verde oscuro. What is the meaning of blue? Azul. Azul. Yes. What is the meaning of light blue? Celeste. Yes. Dark blue? Azul oscuro. Azul oscuro. Yes. Orange? Anaranjado. Yes. Light green? Azul negro. Claro. Verde claro, right. Purple? Morado. Morado. Yes. What is the meaning of black? Negro. Negro. Yes. What is the meaning of white? Blanco. Blanco. Beige? Beige. Beige. Gray? Gris. Gris. Yes. Light gray? Gris claro. Gris claro. Brown? Café. Café. Dark gray? Gris, Gris, oscuro. Gris, oscuro. Gris oscuro. Yes. Now, please ask about favorite colors. For example, eh, Alexis can tell to Nelson what is your favorite colors. Please, pregúntele a Nelson, Alexis. What are your favorite colors or what is? What are your favorite What is color? What is your favorite color? Okay. My favorite color is green. It's green. Now Nelson asked to to Francisco the same question. Okay. Okay. Francisco, what are your favorite colors? Francisco, are you there? Yes, yes. Uh, my mm -hmm. favorite colors are red and black green. Red and, uh, and black, yeah, and green. Now, please ask the same question to Paola. It's blue and black. You can ask, what are your favorite colors or what is your favorite colors? Okay, ask to Paola the same question. Yo hago la pregunta a mí. Ah, que se, no, quizás se le corta la comunicación al compañero. No, él se la iba a hacer a usted. Okay, okay, Paola. Eh, ask to, let me see, to Delmira, the same question. Hi, Delmira. Paola, le, Paola le pregunta a Delmira. What is your favorite color, Tonura? My favorite color is yellow. Okay, Delmira asked to Edgar, Edgar Reyes, the same question. Okay. Hi, Edgar. Hi. What is your favorite color? My favorite color is light green. Okay, now Edgar asked to Fatima the same question. Hi, Farima. What is your favorite color? Hi, Edgar. What is your, what is... My favorite color is purple. Purple. Now, Fatima, ask the same question to uh, Cesar. Cesar, what, what is your favorite color? Good evening, Fatima. My favorite color is light green. Okay, now Cesar ask the same question to Edwin Rivas. Good evening, Edwin. What is your favorite color? My favorite color is gray, dark blue. Okay, dark blue. Now, now, Vaya, aquí vieron cuando a alguien le preguntamos what are, ¿verdad? Your favorite colors, mencionó dos, right? Because we can use are for plurals and use is for singular. That's right. Now, 
Eh, sí, tell me. Token, we say plateado. Plateado, color plata. Puede ser color, sí. quiero ver el gold. Ya le voy a dar otros. Es que les tengo otros acá, pero no silver. se los he preparado. Les, ajá, silver. silver también. Yes. Aquí le voy a mostrar otros. Solo déjenme recortarlo. Ya se lo voy a poner más grande. Silver. Y es silver es plata, ya. Yeah. Silver is. Let me see. Pero aquí tengo unos que también están, son un poco diferentes, que casi no los usamos. Right. Let me see. Ahorita lo muestro. Now. Here we have another ones. Eh, please repeat. Red. All right. Red. Red. Pink. 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 Orange. 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 Yellow. 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 Green. 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 Blue. 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 Purple. 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 Black. 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 White. Great. 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 Brown. Brown. Beige. Beige. Light green. Light green. Dark green. Dark green. Navy blue. Navy blue. Turkeys. 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 Hot pink. Hot pink. Hot pink. Neon green. Neon green. Silver. Aquí está. Ese es el color plata. Mira, el silver. Y el gold. 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 Ok. Now. Vaya, vamos a llegar hasta aquí con la clase de hoy, pero para mañana necesito que escojan por lo menos tres recortes donde hayan diferentes colores. ¿Ya? Because it yeah. is important to mention some eh, combinations about colors. Puedes coger también alguna foto o, o, o algún papel o algo que tenga una combinación de colores. Podría tener tres colores al mismo tiempo o colores individuales, right? Porque mañana vamos a, a, a conocer otros colores, ¿ya? Yeah? Like combination. Yes? Do you have any questions for this class? Uh, no. I have a question. Yes, tell me. No, teacher. Uh, what is the meaning navy blue? Navy blue. Vaya, navy esto, blue. esto se lo voy a, se lo voy a dejar de deber. Es, es que esto se los iba a dar mañana, pero si no, se lo voy a decir ahorita. Déjeme ver. Navy blue navy como blue. azul oscuro. Ajá, como oscuro. Pero eh, quiero que hagamos una combinación de colores, porque ahí vamos a ver, digamos, los colores fuertes con colores suaves. Y... Vamos a hacer una combinación. Déjeme verle. Quiero ver si me lo traduce de otra forma. Porque hay otro azul marino. Hay... Es como un azul marino, el navy blue. Hay otro, ¿verdad, Ticha? Que es sky blue. Sky blue y es azul cielo. Ya. Yeah. Vaya, Pensé miren que este. son los No, no, sí, también <risa> existe colores. así. Y es. Entonces, aquí miren el número 15. Ese azul es diferente, ¿verdad? Miren, yeah. se ve como que fuera negro o entre azul negro, pero es un azul marino, right? Okay. Mm -hmm. Va, y con lo, con lo que hagamos mañana van a, van a aprender más colores porque vamos a hacer una combinación. Eh, don't forget the information, right? For the homework. Only eh, bring three, three pictures with different colors for tomorrow, right? Okay. And then, eh, no, no, no se les olvide entrar a la plataforma para que vean también ahí las clases que están, para que empiecen a hacer los ejercicios. Ya los ejercicios de los colores y de la ropa ya los pueden hacer, porque ya vimos los temas ahora, right? Right. right. Okay. okay. And then, tomorrow we will continue with, with these important presentations, right? Okay. Okay. Thanks for coming. Bye. Have a nice night. Bye. Good night. 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 Good night.
See you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.